Uh, good morning. Um, I'm going to talk a little bit about what we do in the lab. Um, I'm part of the Cardiac MR Center at BIDMC. It's a dedicated cardiac MR program, uh, which involves both clinical and research and education. Uh, we scan about 1,600 patients per year. Uh, half of them are um, uh, just research scan that we do. Um, it's about 20 faculties and uh, research fellows and clinical fellows from all uh, disciplines. We have people from computer science department. Uh, we have people from uh, physics and uh, engineering and cardiology and radiology. Uh, we already have um, international collaboration exchange program. Currently, we have two active exchange program uh, between uh, BI and KCL in London um, that uh, the fellows come here for six months uh, time to do research. Uh, we also, we have uh, same program with ETH in Zurich, which people, students, uh, PhD students and postdocs come here for about three months to six months of uh, just visiting scientists. Okay, so um, the main area of research in uh, my group and our cardiac MR center is really uh, development of cardiac MR imaging methods. Um, so that includes both MR sequence development. We do a lot of new sequences designed for cardiac, and we do image reconstruction, improved image reconstruction for cardiac. Um, in the past few years, we've also moved to multimodality data integration. Uh, that includes electrophysiology data. We're interested in the heart and um, the best way to look at the heart function is really to actually measure with catheter and then you can look at the electrical activity in the heart. And we're interested in looking at what does that mean in terms of the imaging, um, or better say what imaging means in terms of the electrical activation of the heart. We also look at echo. We have a very strong echo program that we look at echo. Um, it's easy, cheap, and you can take it, uh, you just buy an echo machine for $10,000, you can take it to the patient. Uh, so we're trying to use that uh, modality as well. Um, and also, we're trying to do image-guided intervention for cardiac electrophysiology. Um, electrophysi cardiac electrophysiology is one of those unexplored areas, um, which uh, imaging ha could have a very big role in there. Um, so that's one of the areas that we are uh, active in research. So uh, cardiac MR, why we like cardiac MR is really a comprehensive tool for look at the heart. We're interested in look at the heart. We can look at the high-resolution images of the heart. Uh, we can look at the function of the heart that's the heart beats. We can look at the vessel, we can look at the coronaries and look at the wall of the coronaries if you have plaque. Uh, we can look at the angiogram non-invasively. We can look at the flow of the heart. You can look at the 3D blood flow of the heart. And we can also look at the delay enhancement and look at the scar. If you have a heart attack, you're probably gonna have a scar. So there's a lot of prognostic information that you can gain from looking at delay enhancement. And that's what you, you can see is the heart attack. You can see this uh, huge um, scar um, in that image. Um, so we have, uh, over the past year, we have developed our own software, in-house software based on open source that w now we can integrate data from electrophysiology. So these are the kind of the data that you get from electro electrophysiology. Maria mentioned about cardio system that you can get, uh, and these are all numbers about different location of the heart and what electrical activity you have. And we have MR data that shows you the scar, and we're interested in looking, understanding of what, how we can use these two information and integrating them to risk stratify the patient in terms of getting device, if the patient should get an ICD or not get an ICD, and those are the information we can gain by uh, combining these two modalities. So in terms of the wish list, um, we, have, we are a very active group and collaborate with people with very many disciplines. Uh, we are interested in looking at image, imaging algorithm for reconstruction and also data acquisition of cardiac MR. A lot about motion correction, heart moves. It's really hard to image the heart because it's constant moving, so we have to compensate for that respiratory and cardiac motion. Uh, we are interested in looking at methods to fuse the data. We're already working with uh, people at MIT to look at how we can um, fuse these two modalities of electrophysiology data versus cardiac MR data. Um, we are also interested in looking at different contrast agents. I think contrast agents are something that we need um, desperately in a cardiac MR because we need to improve the sensitivity of our data acquisition of cardiac MR. Essentially, we're looking for cool people to work with, and that's uh, what we look for. And here, the contact, you can just Google me and uh, you come to the website. Thank you.